Hey, nerdlings! What's up, nerdlings? <laughs> I don't know where that came from. <laughs> so sorry. <laughs> hey, do you nerd for Funko Pops? All right, nerdlings, so we were tagged by a fellow YouTuber over at Infinity8 for their Funko Friday. And then from US, I'm also challenging Do You Nerd? So um, it's a great channel. I'll leave a link in the description. They go out and about and they just do amazing stuff. So definitely challenging you guys as well because I know you have Funko Pops. This is a fun tag because this is something more in my wheelhouse because most of the time we usually get tagged for like video gamey stuff, but this is more of a, a me thing because this is Funko Species. So the challenge is you have to have at least five Funko figures, pops, whatever they're called, mm. <laughs> and they have to meet a certain criteria. For example, number one is Animal. Yes. And because I do have a plethora of Funkos, we were able to do two. My first Animal. Of course it's a dragon. It's a dragon! And what better dragon than Toothless. Toothless! So do you want to see my animal? I do want to see your animal. Well, my animal is just as vicious and ruthless and mean and terrifying as a dragon because it is the Wolverine! Does that count? He's a person. <laughs> he's, he's an animal. Yeah. Just ask Jean Grey. Oh. <laughs> but don't ask Scott Summers. He'll get mad. <laughs> so, rawr. Um, so, yeah, you know, to be fair, she does have a, a fair amount of Funko Pops. <laughs> and there were some other animals to choose from, but I couldn't resist. Uh, <laughs> calling Wolverine my animal of choice. He's on a motorcycle. And he's nodding in approval. Yes, yes. All right, so number two, and this one, this one's very easy in the Funko Pop world because this one is a human. Oh, a human, uh, you say? How about from Ghostbusters? Oh, uh, totally. Yeah. Yes, well, have some. I would like some coffee. <laughs> <laughs> well, if I'm going to represent the human side, I've got to go with none other than Ash Williams, S-Mart, Housewares. Where's his boomstick? Groovy. Oh, he's got his boomstick. He's got his stick. boomstick. This is my boomstick! So listen up, you primitive screwheads. <laughs> this is his boomstick! Would you like some pizza? <laughs> yes, please. Here, let me catch you a slice. <laughs> now we can share. Yay! <laughs> this tag went Mr. Rogers. All right. Number three is going to be Alien. Aliens! Well, I went with my favorite alien. Oh. Mr. Loki. <laughs> and he's like a double alien because he he's not from Earth, but he's also not from Asgard. <laughs> well, to match that double alien love, what better way than with double hearts oh the doctor and i have to admit capaldi has become my favorite doctor he is a lot of fun i would have to say if it weren't for david Tennant, capaldi would probably be my favorite although i will say it's a funny bit with the sonic shades but i didn't really like the sonic shades yeah. so next is robot robot robots we're robots Robots. Well, in I went with disguise. the first robot I ever fell in love with, which would be Mr. R2-D2. Oh, nice. And you even got the drink one. I did. I got the drink one there. Well, we got to get some video game love out here, and I think he's pretty much a robot, so I went with Songbird. He's ginormous. <laughs> so from Bioshock Infinite, uh, oh yeah, when he's freaking flying around terrorizing you while you're trying to get around on the, uh, the zipline things, mm -hmm. oh my gosh. 
Yeah, he's huge. So let him just kind of loom right over. <laughs> <laughs> and the final category is mystical creature. Mystical. So well, let's let's see if we're on the same page with this one. What's more mystical than a unicorn? Oh, too true. Or a Deadpool. That's that's hilarious. <laughs> but you know, I figured it's it's more I went for the unicorn. Deadpool just happens to be riding it, so you know. He, <laughs> He's got his little gun back there. That's kind of fun. Well, hey, if I'm going to go with a mystical creature, I will give you guys just one hint. Uh, Ariel? Uh, a little mermaid? Uh, uh, mostly right. Well, that's the wrong red-headed mermaid. <laughs> Didn't it <see? laughs> It's a Deadpool mermaid. <laughs> He's got a freaking harpoon gun. <laughs> and uh, seashells. Oh, yeah. Hey, do you know why the Little Mermaid wears seashells? Because the bee shells are too small. Oh! Uh-oh! <laughs> <laughs> All right, so for starters, I would like to thank Infinity 8 for thinking of us and tagging us for this fun Funko Pop. This was a lot of fun. It was fun to go through them and try to figure out which ones we wanted to use. Yeah, and to have a little fun with them. Yeah. You know, kind of kind of push the boundaries with your alien, your mystical creatures, mm -hmm. robots or animal. Like, <laughs> he still agrees. Uh, <laughs> well, first of all, I do want to say, please go check out Infinity 8, especially if you like Funko Pop, mm -hmm. because they always have so many awesome Funko Pops. Like, like seriously, click on one of their videos, and what you see behind us, just imagine that all boxed Funko Pops. See, yeah. but that's where I have the problem, though. You can't enjoy them <laughs> in the boxes. You can't see all the cool detail. Like I said, look back behind here. He's got his gun. You'd never see that in the box. Take him out of the box. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, this is typically the part where we would tag someone. However, here's an issue that we usually have with tagging people. You never know if you're tagging someone that's already been tagged mm -hmm. or if you're tagging someone that's not really interested in doing a follow-up video or anything like that. And you don't want to leave anybody out. Yeah. So how about this? How about we tag any of you who would like to take the Funko Species Challenge? I will leave down in the description below what five you need. So and you, right there, you sitting right there at your desk? With them over there? Uh-huh. I'm tagging you. Wait. I want to see your five. This one's not at their desk. So did you mean them or this mm. one? Oh, yeah. Maybe this person sitting on the bus watching with okay. their phone. Yeah. I'm tagging you, too. Oh, and you on the train. I'm tagging you on the train. Oh. And, oh, and you know, you just sitting on your couch watching this stuff. Mm -hmm. Tagging you. So all of you. Yes. But, yeah, anybody who would like to take part of this. And feel free to tag someone afterwards yeah. if you would like to. But for now, we are just kind to throw that out there to anybody who wants to. Again, check out the links in the description below, both to Infinity 8's channel and then uh, the criteria for yes. what Funko figures you need to find. Be sure to like, leave some comments down below on our picks. Maybe you don't agree, he's quite the animal. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. Don't forget to like us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram so that you can see what we're doing out and about in the real world to know that YouTube has dropped a video and to go over to Tee Public and pick up our merchandise because we want to see you in our merchandise. And nerdlings, if we like it, we nerd it. Isn't that right, Wolverine? Is he scared? His he bones are red. <laughs> <laughs> that that sounded like the uh, that sounded like the <laughs> the kitchen drawer with all the utensils in it for his bones to rattle. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. Ready? I still feel like we're doing a um, newsreel. Well, I will let you beep, tell beep, me beep, when beep, you're ready. Beep, 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 this just did. Beep, 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 beep. Okay. <laughs> get the happy beep sound. Beep, 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 So you get to pick one, and I get to pick one. So, the first one for animal. <laughs> what? No? What did you say? 